Welcome to Microwave Delights! Hello, Air Pink. What do you have there? Looks delicious! Isn't that neat? How long do we cook that? You'll be full in no time! Time to prepare that wonderful food! Make sure you follow the instructions! Just the press of a button and we're cooking! While you're waiting, you can occupy your time with an important activity. Look! It's TV magic! Time to enjoy that delightful meal! My uh. the delights! Uh, the from, oh, the, the, from the microwave. Are we really trying to put that moniker on? It? <laughs> this is no yeah. delight. It came from a mi There's no delight. Okay. Mm, yeah. <laughs> uh. Um. So I didn't really even know that you could buy vegetarian White Castle. Yeah. Especially, I didn't know that you could buy it in two different varieties. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I knew they were testing it out. Veg vegetal, and you have black bean. Can we? Can we? Can we just? <laughs> oh God! It comes apart. I was trying to pick it up from the bottom. It's like, ah, oh, it squishes oh, out. It's just a package of frozen carrots and peas. Yeah. <laughs> that looks terrible, man. Oh no! All right. Well, there's that. Is that one gonna be first? And there's the black bean one. Yeah, I'm good. Uh, nope! Uh, Work part. Uh, oh, jeez. That's just bean. Yeah, just bean. try the vegetable first. Yeah. <laughs> Should. Like, I heard that they were doing the vegetable one. I heard it wasn't that bad, but... Well, here's the thing. They also, at, at the actual restaurants, you can get the, uh, the, um... Impossible Burger version? Impossible Burger? Well, okay, yeah, maybe maybe that's what I was... Yeah, but it's I definitely not about. either of these things. No, this yeah. does... I don't know what the fuck this is. So. Yeah, I don't know if it's Impossible <laughs> Burger or the uh, the other one, the, um... It's definitely not the Impossible Burger. Whatever the hell yeah. it's called. Okay, yeah, because, like, the one that we had that bled, that thing was yeah. good. All right. Just the... go, go, go for Let's it. Get in there, dude. Cheers. We would like peas and carrots again. <laughs> does it taste like a delicious White Castle slider? The bun does, yes. Oh my god. <laughs> Loki. There was so much vegetable in there. What's wrong, Loki? Okay, if I was making like a chicken soup, I would, you know, grill up some onions and carrots and celery. Yeah. And then I would add other ingredients to it. This is just like I left that on the stove for like a day or two <laughs> on a really low temperature. And it all just kind of became a mash but the, with little tiny bits of texture. I was going to say, but like there are some peas and carrots that do give you some texture to it. Is like, there rice in there too? Maybe. That might be what's making up the rest of the base. That is a weird product. Yes. I don't like... Let's not throw the word burger at this. <laughs> no, or even burger. Burger. Mm. Yeah, no, th this... Like, if I wasn't having this in this format, I could see this being okay. Like, if, it was, still be if it was just like, okay, you're just eating a vegetable cake of some sort. All right. I mean, not like super flavorful by any mean, but like if, if it was just like, you're gonna eat this weird vegetable patty, that's fine. But as a White Castle veggie burger, uh, there's some serious fucked up going on here. It's like if you had a quiche, but no eggs, and the crust was like s soggy, and it became two pieces of bun. <laughs> And like there was no spinach or broccoli or anything strong tasting in it. It's just like vegetable mush around a mushy bun. And it smells like a jock strap. Can we say that? Mm -hmm. Like it, it's terrible up in my face. <laughs> and then after I start chewing it, I'm like, wow, really unimpressed. Okay, so sniff that one, then sniff that one. Oh, I would much rather man. sniff that jock strap than that jock strap. This one smells kind of oddly like a pizza crust. Really? I, dude, this smells like fucking weird soy butthole. 
Now we're looking at Dr. Henry Johns, Lindemans. Oh, this is gonna be great, he's a, he's a doctor. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's hope that's a doctorate and stomping on grapes. This is the best Australian Shiraz four dollars can buy. Oh <laughs> yeah, baby! All right. You know what? I'm 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 guessing it probably still isn't that bad. I like how it smells. Definitely cuts through that veggie. Ooh. Mm -hmm. It's kind of twangy. It's a little drier than I would expect a Shiraz to be. Yeah, okay. I'd say it reminds me of other kinds of reds than in, uh, than a Shiraz, but I still yeah. like it as a red. No, this isn't bad. Like, I would drink this, like, yeah. more than... I mean, for four bucks, fuck, let's do this. Mm-hmm. All, All right. right. Black bean hose. <sighs> fuck. All right, let's okay. try this. Okay. That just smells terrible. Those <sighs> beans. Those, my friend, are beans. <laughs> There's that weird soy, saucy, earthy butthole flavor that... Are we talking like pock? Well, no, like like the, the like the glutens and stuff like that, those are fine. But like when you get like a field glow or the, the fucking like tofurkeys and stuff like that, there's just this weird flavor that they have that... I don't know what it is that makes that flavor, but like this has it. It's gross. Mm. It doesn't remind me too much of tofurkey. Like tofurkey reminds me of inner tube, you know? Well, I mean, yeah, because like the there's that other flavor. But there's tube. just always, to me, like everything that I've had that's supposed to be like vegan y has this weird underlying flavor that I just can't get behind. Texturally, though, the black bean one does kind of remind me of a burger more so than. The veggie one, but the, it's got better texture. But like the flavor, I just yeah, it's, I don't know what that funk is, but I just can't get get down with it. To me, it tastes like beans, heavily seasoned beans, but beans. White Castle is such a narrow market in the freezer aisle, anyways. Yeah, yeah. like there's a very small subset of people that are in there buying those things. Uh. Yeah, and it's where <laughs> <laughs> pretty much. Yeah, so. To further diverge that audience into a vegetarian version of that, mm -hmm. like, is there even an audience for that? No, there I don't isn't. Think so. And like, <laughs> I don't get it. Like, going to the restaurant, maybe, because you said like they were like the Impossible Burgers. Yeah. Right? Like that, I could get down behind. Like that, we've had a variation of that, and it, that was really good. These are not good. So, like, to throw this out here and be like, oh, vegetarian, white, like, they're, White Castle's doing a disservice by doing this. Mm. Like, they're fucking themselves in the long run because people are going to be like, oh, that's that vegetarian burger that White Castle did. I'm going to get you one of these and just be like, what the fuck is this? When in all actuality, they're serving up a very, like, a farther superior product at the store yeah. than this. Where, like, a White Castle burger... Like, yeah, you can tell a difference if you get it in the restaurant, but I mean, you get a fucking frozen White Castle cheeseburger thrown in a microwave for a minute, and it's like, this is White Castle. I'm good. I'm good. You get a White Castle in the freezer aisle because you have a hankering for that particular flavor because That's, you're really high. <laughs> yeah, and and you're not we're, going after yeah. something quality. Yeah, nobody's like, yeah. oh man, I have a hankering for that black bean uh -huh. White no. Castle. Yeah. No, that's just there to to give the feed your one friend yeah. that needs a black bean version because, you know, yeah. you're there with your group of stoner friends and one of them's a vegetarian. They just have it there out of desperation. Exactly. But what we're talking about is like, you need to win the Daytona 500 and you're going <laughs> to a golf cart company. They're like, set me up with your best race car. And they're like, we don't have race cars here. What are you talking about? So they throw a V8 and a tiny little, you know, land cruiser. And yeah, it's just bad news. This is not what you, this is the wrong direction to go with this product. I am not even going to waste Jufron on these things. No, no, yeah. no. All right, then what's your scores? The wine, I'm giving a five. 
Like, it's not a Shiraz I really uh, recognize as a Shiraz, but I, I would still get it again if it's four ninety nine. <laughs> yeah, for four ninety nine for the flavor, I, I'm gonna give this a six. Like, it, this, the wine is fantastic, especially compared to the shit show that we ate. Even though the this. vegetarian burger smells better, <laughs> I'm going to give that one a three. Like, I, I think it, it fails in every other aspect of being a burger. It's not, it's like a soup-based starter in a bun. <laughs> and over here with the Boca burger or the black bean burger or whatever, I'm giving that one a four. Like, I agree with that one just a tiny bit more, but it's just beans. Okay, I agree on your score for the bit. The veggie, not for the same reasons. So three, that black bean thing is a two. Like, fuck that noise, I'm out. So yeah, White Castle, uh, don't do this. <laughs> Stick to making your shitty fucking cheeseburgers, man. Yeah. Nobody uh, asked for this, stop doing it, quit wasting your time and money. Just make your normal bullshit. So thank you for joining us on Microwave Delights. This time we had Utter horrific shit! And some nice wine. Mm. Hooray! Make sure to join us next time and let us know uh, what uh, appropriate vegan products you should try to serve to a crowd. There's the corn out of that turd. Yeah, we know that this ain't the one. So make sure to like, comment, subscribe, check out all of our social media. Check me out over on twitch.tv forward slash Wolfram Glasses. And we will catch you next time we fire up that microwave shit. Oh, boo!